I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America, and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for the Texas Pledge. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to the Texas, one state, under God, one and indivisible. Please remain standing for a moment of silence. Reporting from Studio C of the Tor Nation TV Complex and the Media Arts Learning Community at Ball High School in Galveston, Texas, I'm Alex and welcome aboard the Express. Today is Friday, May 13th, 2016. Attention Lip Dubbers. Lip Dub practices every day after school at 345 in Mr. Judas's room. All selected Lip Dubbers must be present daily at 345 for mandatory rehearsals. The Interact Volleyball Tournament Serve for Those Who Serve is May 18th at 4 o'clock. Registration is $25 per team. Each grade level and athletic group are challenge to put a team together to see who will be the team to beat in this year's four games. See Ms. Profit in room 2015 for details. The teachers versus student basketball game is here again. The big game will be played today. Tickets are on sale for $1 during all lunch periods. Attention students, the new car that is parked at the steps of the clock entrance will be given away on May 20th. If you had perfect attendance any six weeks this year, your name will be in the drawing. To verify, check the lists posted outside Mr. Spencer's office. Please report any discrepancies to Mr. Spencer or Mrs. Schweitzer by today. The second annual tour games is scheduled for May 27th. It's time to get involved and start thinking about the events and organizing your grade level teams. Last year's freshman class of 2018 won. See Mr. Spencer or Coach Barker for more details. Attention seniors, all colleges will need a final transcript with a graduating date. Stop by the registrar's office and see Mrs. Santos or Mrs. Alcacer to fill out a final request form. The Ball High School JRTC has organized a 5K buddy run on May 21st called Storm the Beaches. The event will be held along the seawall. Military booths and veteran-friendly support groups will be in attendance. To sign up to run or walk, see Mr. Major Knight for more information. Anyone who wishes to sell artwork at the Emily Munson Memorial Art Sale should submit artwork or ceramics to any art teacher or Mrs. Schweitzer by May 21st. The event is May 24th from 4 to 7 in the lobby of the auditorium. See Mrs. Schweitzer for more information information. Attention match day ceremony attendees. Your PowerPoint slide and personal information sheet were due to Mrs. Puig by last Monday. If you have not done so already, please submit those documents. The Sea Scout Base Galveston is sponsoring the U.S. Sailing Reach Camp from July 25th to 29th. At the summer camp, students explore STEM as it applies to sailing. For further information, contact Abigail Hills at 409-572-2560, extension 10 being in high school gives you access to attend some cool trips. One such trip is being planned for next spring break to New York City. See all the sites including Rockefeller Center, Fifth Avenue, Radio City Music Hall, Times Square, the Empire State Building, the Statue of Liberty, Ellis Island, the 9-11 Memorial and Museum, and much more. All of this including attending several workshops and going to two to three Broadway plays. Sign up now. See Mr. Judas for more information. Also, for the 12th consecutive year, Ball High students, faculty, parents, and staff will be traveling internationally for for a spring break educational tour. Next year, the itinerary will highlight the French Riviera, including Monaco, Monte Carlo, and Nice. Students will also take a train to Paris and visit the historic beaches of Normandy. See Miss King for more information. Anyone who wishes to be considered for the National Art Honor Society for the 2016-17 school year should apply with Mrs. Moore, Mrs. Lipo, or Miss Tally. You must have two years of high school art, maintain an 85 average, and have no major discipline or attendance issues. All requests must be turned in by May 20th. See Mrs. Moore for more information. Attention seniors, if you have not sold at least one project graduation ticket, stop by and see Mrs. Purcell by next Friday. Every five that you sell, you will receive a $50 Visa gift card. The Project Graduation Prize Patrol will be making surprise visits in the coming weeks. Sell, sell, sell. Attention students from the biomedical community, the white coat ceremony has been scheduled for next Thursday during the first period in the auditorium. Dress to impress in your black and white attire. If you are not sure which community you belong to, check your ID badge for the number 602. Think you are pound for pound the strongest at ball high? Are you ready to go over the top? Tour games, powerlifting, and arm wrestling is upon us soon. See Mr. Bueller in room 1049 to sign up by May 20th. Attention seniors, library finds and over 
overdue books stay on your record until books are returned or fines are paid. Your account must be cleared before you can walk at graduation. Your official weather forecast in the ground calls for sunshines and clouds mixed with a high of 82. Tonight, expect partly cloudy skies and a low of 71. As a reminder, the Express is recorded 24 hours in advance. To get your announcements on the Express, please submit your request at least 48 hours in advance. Stay tuned for today's Time Rewind, Christopher Good Friend, David Mendel. Suddenly, shots from the crowd. It's Time Rewind from May 13th. In 1981, just weeks after a gunman tried to kill President Ronald Reagan, another attempt is made on the life of a public figure. This time, it's Pope John Paul II in Rome. John Paul slumped into the arms of his private secretary, was rushed back out of St. Peter's Square, past the stunned pilgrims and tourists who moments before had been crowding close for a touch, a word, or a smile. The pontiff recovers from his gunshot wounds and is released from the hospital three weeks later. Turkish terrorist Mehmet Ali Aja is eventually convicted in the case. Recognize that sound? That is fastening made simple. It's Velcro, trademarked on this day in 1958. Fast forward to 1967 when the Supremes reign over the singles chart with The Happening. That's Time Rewind. I'm David Mandel. In addition to the website, Time Rewinds on Facebook, Instagram, Pinterest, Google Plus, and Twitter. Check it out for you for more history and pop culture info. Reporting from the Tour Nation TV Complex and Media Arts Learning Community at Ball High School in Galveston, Texas, I'm Alex wishing you a terrific day. A lot of love.